Welcome to Inside South Florida and happy International Women's Day. I am Gabrielle Arzola. Joining me at the top of our show to celebrate is our very own Cameron Dobbs. Hi. Hi, Gabby. Happy International Women's Day to you. Thank you so much. And to you as well. Oh, thank you. Well, Gabby, today I come to studio with a story. You ready for this? I am so excited. Okay, get this. We all know the sports industry has typically been dominated by men. But this past year, women have taken over, and I, working as a woman in sports, absolutely love it. From female athletes, Caitlin Clark being NCAA's new all-time leading scorer in college basketball, to family, friends, fashion, and famous people. Taylor Swift is dating Travis Kelsey. Woo. Kristen Juszczyk, wife of the 49ers Kyle Juszczyk, her game day designs for wives and girlfriends are viral all over the country. And here in South Florida, we have our very own courtside queen, the jersey dress designer herself. Check this out. My name is Radmila Lali, and I am a musician and a designer. So I compose, I write, um, songwrite, and sing, and I play different instruments for compositions. Lolly is loaded with talent, but what brought us to her showroom was her famous fashion designs seen on the sidelines at South Florida sporting events, starting with the Miami Heat. Well, I started going to the games and I fell in love with the culture and the energy of the fans and I wanted to express the same support to my team. I just did not find anything that I particularly liked for me to wear. Um, so I bought a bunch of jerseys and created a gown out of it. So my style, my team, and I think it's a great synergy. <laughs> Just like the athletes, game days are a workout for Lolly too. They're not light. No, I mean, 16 <laughs> jerseys. <laughs> it's, what was it? Do you feel like they weigh you down when you're wearing them? Mm -mm. Well, I, I perform in like 50 pounds outfit, so. True, this it's, is nothing to you. No. I only started fashions because of music. I usually put a music on and, or I play an instrument, and then the lines and the volume and the shapes comes to life while I play. So I play and sketch, I play and sketch. How long does it usually take to make one of these dresses? Well, the first one took a while, but now I think we can do it in three, uh, sorry, eight hours, about three people. Do you ever repeat an outfit? No, not yet. Don't be fooled by the fun fashion. Lolly is locked in, and some styles even include stats. So look, I wrote down the names and the score of <gasps> when we lost to Celtics, game seven. <laughs> And then I said, we'll be back. And then guess what? We won. Celtics the following oh year, year later. So I thought it was very special. No matter how many designs she creates, Lolly remains in awe of the life she's living. Who would have thought I would be Miami Heat uh, person? If you would have told me that 10 years ago, I would not believe. But never have anybody to tell you what you can, what you can't do. Whatever feels right to you, you live once. So I mean, I want to wear what I want to wear. <laughs> the heat might have sparked her courtside to tour, but Lolly is far from satisfied from her mark on Miami sports teams, now tackling unique university wear, something she has never had a chance to do before. Obviously, I'm a foreigner, and I did not know what college culture is. And being there and just feeling it, and you know, a little bit, I'm a little envious that I didn't get that experience when I was younger, you know, going to school and feeling the campus and feeling that culture. But in a way, I feel like it's second chance. Her first Hurricanes game, Lolly wore a heat dress. But while at the Watsco Center, she started having conversations about not just a new gown, but a new Canes collection. And it didn't take long to launch. The Hurricanes pieces put the power in the hands of the shopper, as the perfectly placed zippers designate different ways to style the set so that, like Lolly, they don't have to repeat their outfits either. Now, Lolly echoes her Canes fans, knowing it is all about the U. Feels amazing to be part of the team and part of the culture, so I'm very grateful to be accepted. Accepted and respected. Lolly says athletes of each organization always interact and give credit to her creativity. Even Formula One's Lewis Hamilton added his own mark, his signature near his name on her jersey jumpsuit. You're extremely committed to this. Yes. <laughs> Why? Um, well, I think we all have a voice and we express ourselves through fashion. Her refusal to silence her style comes from a confidence molded by her mother, her biggest role model that she's highlighting this Women's History Month. Mom gave me all the foundation to believe. I could be anything I wanted to be and she gave me all the love in the world. Now, 
she's passing the baton. I would love to meet more women, never can inspire one. It's already, my job is done. And like I said, we on this earth for a very short time, but the legacy can live for so long, positive legacy. In the future, Lolly is looking to launch books, plays, music, maybe even movies, and of course, more collections. I want to have it in every sport and every team and to see my every fan to support their team and my passion. So for everyone who wants to get their very own dress or collection of this Miami Hurricanes, where can we find them? Hurricane um, Team Store and online.